Hallelujah, hallelujah. It's in your turn. I will rock up tonight. Bid Midbar, Numbers 14 and 8, Israel. If Yahweh delight in us, then he will bring us into the land and give it us a land which flows with milk and honey. But what is Israel Yah delight? Our delight should be in his misfire. For in his misfire is what guides us, is what keeps our feet shod with the preparation of Yahshua HaMashiach. For in his misfire delivered Zagrak, Meshach, and Abednego as a king of Romeo was telling us. For in his misfire, Yisrael, y'all, y'all open up the earth because of the wickedness of sin and cause of people to go down in. In his misfire, Yisrael, y'all, he caused one to shed the pressure of the dome for Yisrael, y'all, to make us a special people that we delight in Yah's misfire, that we walk according to have commanded us to do, Yisrael, Yah. That is the only way that we're going to stand in these last and evil days, is walking in his misfire, his commandments that he has commanded us to do. And in his commandment, we do not choose and pick. He said that Every man should live by every word, not bread alone, but every word that proceeds out the mouth of Yah. And every word we got to abide by Yisrael Yah. Because it is a commandment of Yah to Yisrael Yah. Turn with me to Tehillim 119. For Yah have brought us out of darkness into his marvelous light to walk. And let us read as our, our that we tell us in Tehillim 119 and 35. Now he says, don't ask, don't tell me, make me to go direct. In the pathway, not thieve, of your commandments. Well, let's look at that pathway. It says in Tehillim 16 and 11. If you will make me to know through the path of aura, the Hebrew word, of life, in your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand, there are pleasures forevermore. But for us to get there, Yisrael, we got to abide in his mitzvah. We got to walk as he had commanded us to walk, Yisrael. And it says in Tehillim 25 and 4, two verses, it says, make me to know your way, your direct. Oh, Yahweh, teach me your path. Lead me in your mitzvah, Abba Yahweh. For I know I wander and my feet to go astray. I need your guidance through your misfocks, Abba Yahweh. It said, lead me in your verse 5. It said, lead me in your truth, your misfocks, your commandments, Abba Yahweh. Teach me, Abba Yahweh. For only you can teach me, Abba Yahweh. For my ways are not your ways. For you are the sovereign master of my deliverance. You are my yashat. And on you do I wait all the day, trusted in your misfire, that it direct my path, that it be forever on my mind. Oh, Abba Yahweh, teach me tonight, Abba Yahweh. And then it says in one verse, Psalms 112 and 1, it said, Barak Yah, hallelujah. It said, blessed is the man that fear Yahweh. But that his delight 
is greatly, greatly in his commandments, Israel, y'all. For that man knows that is the only strength that he has to endure and to go through and to make him a violent warrior in this fight, Israel, y'all. His misfire. Nothing of our own doing, of our own will, or our own way. But it's all about Yah, Yisrael Yah, and his misfire, his Torah, to keep us on this journey. Just a little while, just a little while. Turn to Tehillim 119 and 47. Oh, we will rock you tonight, Abba Yahweh. And I will delight myself in your commandments, your misfits, which I have loved. Why? Because they have transformed me. They have changed me. They have brought me out of that darkness into his marvelous light and to make me a special people and gave me a testimony of his precious son, Yahshua Hamashiach, and to stand on Yisrael, yeah. to let the people know that Yah do have one that's going to stand, that's not going to back down, and not going to be ashamed of his commandments. And it goes on to say in 48, my hands will I lift up to your commandments, which I have, and I will meditate in your statutes. Day and night. That is just the delight of Israel, his misfire. Israel, turn to bury sheep. Genesis twenty six and four. For Yah is so tough, Israel, and for surety, he's gonna stand on his misfire. It says, I will make your seed to multiply as the stars of the heaven and will give you to your seed all these countries. And in your seed shall all the nations of the earth be blessed because that Abraham obeyed my voice. Let us be like Abraham, Yisrael. Let us obey the voice of Abba Yahweh. And what else did it say? Kept my charge. Help me to keep your charge and my commandments, my statutes. And it goes on to say my Torah. Yes, Abba Yahweh. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, Torah, yeah. Torah, yeah. Help us, Abba Yahweh. She about Exodus 20 and 2. I am Yahweh, your Almighty which have brought you out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. You should have no other, quote, God before me, which is his first commandment, Israel. You should not make to you any carved image, as I came, your Romeo spoke to us, or any likeness of anything that is in the Hashemayim. Yah yeah, means what he says, Israel. Yeah. Above, or that in the earth, beneath, or that in the water, under the earth. You should not bow down to yourself, to them, nor serve them. For I, Yahweh, your ch children to the third and fourth generation, of them that hate me. Y'all gonna bring recompense. Showing steadfast love kindness to thousands of them that are hover me and keep my commandments, Israel. You should not take the name of Yahweh, your Almighty, in vain. For Yahweh will not hold him guiltless that take his name in vain. But this says, Remember the Shabbat and keep it Kodush. 
Israel, y'all. Because it says set apart from this wicked and toward generation. Israel, y'all. Because y'all have gave us a commandment to abide by. Turn to Debram, Deuteronomy 4 and 39. To keep it in our lab, to apply, to walk, to stand steadfast, be immovable. Debram, Deuteronomy 4 and 39 says, No, therefore this day, and consider it in your land that Yahweh is sovereign in the high shemai and above. All the earth and beneath, there is none else. And you should keep, therefore, his statutes, Israel, and his mitzvah, which I command you this day. That it may go well with you. That you may be able to endure. That you may be able to go through. That there be no weary, no doubt, Israel. Yes, yes, yes. But stand fast. Be strong. Be of good courage, Israel. Yes. Children after you. That you may prolong your days upon the earth. Which Yahweh, your almighty, give you forever, Israel. Just trust in his mitzvah. Keep it within your land. Yeah. To Helium 119 and 127. Told you, Abba Yahweh, that you have gave us everything we need in your mitzvah, and your Torah, yeah. to abide by for this short time. Therefore, I hover your mitzvah above gold, above anything this world can offer Israel, y'all. Land, houses, cars, riches, nothing is above y'all's mitzvah. Why? Because them things is going to pass away. They are only temporary, Israel, y'all. And above fine gold. Therefore, I esteem all your precepts. To heaven and this earth shall pass away, but not one jot. I want tilt of your misfire, Abba Yahweh. Your precepts concerning all these things to be 100% right, Israel. And I hate every false way. And he do hate every false way. He do hate all those that's going against his Torah. Israel, y'all. Turn with me to 119, 143. As that we say, trouble and anguish have taken hold on me. But then he tells us of what to do to get strength, Israel. Yet your commandments are my delight. Your demands is my strength. Your misfox is my shalom, Israel. Your misfox is what keeps me on that straight path, Israel. Your misfox is the one that keeps me standing steadfast to go on to the end. That I may enter into that male coop. Israel, y'all. Yeah. Isn't y'all tough? Yeah. Yeah. That he love Israel, y'all. Yeah. Verse 145. Oh, we need to do this to y'all sometime. I cry with my whole leg. Answer me, O Yahweh. I will keep your statutes. I cry to you, and you deliver me, Abba Yahweh. By my misfox, you show me what I need to do and how I need to walk. I shall keep your testimonies. Verse 147, I have prevented the dawning of the morning and cried. I hope in your misfox, Abba Yahweh, not other things of this life, Abba Yahweh. My eyes prevent the night watches, that I may meditate on your Torah. 
your midst, for I be Yahweh. That as I rise in the morning, knowing my enemy is going to be there, that I'll be able to stand, Abba Yahweh. That I'll be able to go through the day. That I'll make sure that I have my shield and my sword. Hear my voice according to your steadfast love, kindness, O Abba Yahweh. Quicken me according to your judgment. For they draw nigh that fall after mischief. But they are far from your Torah, Israel. You are near, O Yahweh, all your commandments. Not some, but all of your commandments are true, Israel. Concerning your testimonies, I have known of old that you have founded them forever. Israel, he's going to stand in his misfox, Israel. All we have to do is just walk and be obedient and obey. Turn to Yokohan, 1 John 2 and 3. Told the that he have barracked us and gave us all the tools that we need to endure. And hereby we do know that we know him, for we keep his commandments. And he that said, I know him, and keep not his commandments, is a liar, Yisrael. And then it goes on to say the truth is not in him. But whoso keeps his word, Israel, in him, verily is the Ahava Yahweh made perfect through Yah's Mitzvah, Israel. Hereby know that we are in him and we keep his Mitzvah because it is him, Israel. Turn to Yokohan, first Yokohan, John 3 and 22. Oh, Todiyah, for your misfire, your commandments that you have gave us, Abba Yahweh. That we can keep it with us from day to day, even in the evening. It says, Yokohan, 1 John 3 and 22. And whatsoever we ask, we receive of him, because we keep his misfires. And we do those things that are pleasing in his sight. Yes, they are. For he commanded us to walk in his misfire. He commanded us how to talk. In his misfire. He commanded us how to present ourselves as a set apart people in his misfire. Israel. No excuse I will have, Israel. Because he gave us a commandment, a misfire to abide by. And this is his commandment. Yes, it is. That we should believe on the name of his son, Yahshua HaMashiach, and Ahava one another. He gave us a commandment, and he that keeps this commandment dwells in him, Yisrael, and he in him, and we keep his misfire, Yisrael. We that walk in our own ways of a carnal con- man. Con- man. Israel, and here, hereby we know that he abides in us by the ruach which he has given us in his misfire. Israel, oh, give me this to hear tonight, Abba Yahweh. That as I walk as you have commanded me to walk in your misfire. For in this misfire, there's no wavering and there's no compromise. 
No straddles in the fence. For he said, where well, lukewarm is right now. Then he's going to spew us out of his mouth. For we got to abide in his commandment and it got to be rooted within our land. Us not being ashamed. Giyana, Revelation 14 and 12. Here is the patience of the condition. Here are they that keep the commandments of Yahweh. Yisrael. And the Imuna of Yahshua HaMashiach. For he showed us of that we could stand in his mitzvah. When he fasted 40 days, and for that night, and was tempted. And Yah say, man should not live by bread alone, but every word that proceeds out of the mouth of Yah. He went through it, Yisrael, Yah. Believing in his mitzvah. Oh, Abba Yahweh. Yahyana, Revelation 22 and 14. What a mighty Yah we serve. Yes, sir. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. 22 and 14 says, Blessed are they that do his commandments. Barak are they that do his commandments, Israel. And that they may have right to the tree of life. Why? Because they're abiding by the will of Yah. They're doing what Yah have commanded them to do. And may enter and through the gates into the city. But to get into that city, we got to abide in his midst box. We got to walk, Israel. We got to speak. And we got to be Israel. A people that stand steadfast fast and not soon shaken. When we're confronted, Israel, that they may see that we're that people, that the misfire is true within our land, Israel. For we're going to be judged. Just stand on his misfire, Israel. Don't back down. For we see. Hi, Satan. And we see how bold he is. is. And the scripture said that we could be bold of the lion in Yah's misfire. Oh, Abba Yahweh. I told you tonight, Abba Yahweh. For this word, Abba Yahweh. To let me know of the shortcomings of how I missed. His misfires, Israel. But total y'all of his heart seed, his tender mercy and his love kindness. That he gave me a chance to soothe to get it right and get back on the right track. And walk as he commanded us to walk. Marcus, Mark 12 and 28. Just endure a little while longer. Payday is their faith. It's coming out the while, Israel. For total Yah, that you have those that stand and teach and strengthen Israel, Yah. Every foreigner, at four, four corners of the old land, to let them know that it's going to take Yah's misfire to endure this race, to go through, that they may think that they could do what they want to do, walk the way they want to walk. But that's not so, Israel, y'all. For Yah has gave us a commandment to abide by, and he has gave us a misfire. And we're going to be judged by that misfire. And told the Yah that Yah have men that speak and to let us know that it ain't going to be that way. 
that we just ain't gonna get into Hashemayim any kind of way, Israel. Yeah. That we got to do as y'all told us to do. And our life got to be changed. And our man, mind got to be transformed into that mind of Yahshua HaMashiach. And the misfits can do that, Yisrael. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, total Yah for your word, Abba Yahweh. Oh, your true word. Because there's no error in it, Abba Yahweh. And as one of the scribes came, and having heard them reasoning together, and perceiving that he had answered them, answered them well, and asked him, which is the first commandment of all? And Yahshua answered him, the first of all the commandments is, hear, O Israel, Yah, the word of Yah. Yahweh our Abba, Yahweh is one. And there's none like thee. And you shall have Yahweh your Abba will follow your leg. And will follow your nephesh. And will follow your mind. And will follow your strength. This is the first commandment. So then it goes on. Father to tell us this. And the second is like namely this. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. There's none other commandment greater than these, Israel. Yeah. And that is a commandment that he has commanded to us, Israel. Yeah. That we do love our neighbor as ourselves. We got to walk by every word that Yah gives us, Israel. Yeah. No compromising, no kind of way. Because Israel, it ain't but a little while longer that we have to endure. That's one reason why his misfits got to be real within my land, that I'd be able to stand. Are the things of this life, Israel, will draw me, Israel, will turn me away from his mitzvah, Israel. Don't think, Israel, that we don't stand on his mitzvah, that we'll be able to not stand against the war in the wild of this adulterous and wicked generation. And this is a wicked generation, Israel. Told y'all that he's so tough to us. And he give us all the equipment that we need to fight this welfare. Yes, Ray. I'll barack y'all for that. Yes, Ray. That in his misfire, he stripped, he tear down everything in us that's not of him. And that need to be done, Israel. Yeah. We need to be changed, transformed, and made that new man of Yahshua HaMashiach. The head misfire be constantly upon our mind, Israel. Yeah. That we speak, it be speak of his misfire, his words. Not of the things of foolishness. Not of the things of this life. That have no meaning, that is no strength to us, Israel. For it ain't nothing, and it ain't time for nothing. But about Yah. But about Yah. About Yah. No matter how it hurts, or how it corrects us, or how it shows us us, it's still about Yah and His misfire. His guidance, his leadings. Not our way, our will. But that right there should have been taken away from us. 
but he's still working on us, as the king says, step by step, to bring us into that perfect man. Yes, Ray, y'all. Because we just don't know how, yeah, or how we use where you are. That's why he gave us a misfire to abide by and to go by every word. Not us just pick a word and skip that and then go to that, but every word, every word, every word, every word. Every word. It's going to take that for us, Israel, y'all. It's going to take that for us to stand. Because you can't stand for we're no match for our ever saving. But through Yah and his misfathers, we can stand. We can stand. Because we're not fighting the flesh and blood, but just of the Ruach, Israel, Yah. As the song say, he's sweet, I know. And so is his misfathers to Israel, Yah. Yes, yes, he is. Hallelujah, hallelujah. How can I help from not praising his name, Israel? Oh, Abba Yahweh. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, Abba Yahweh. Told you that you have brought us into your body. To feed us tonight. Oh, you're so tough, Israel. You're so tough. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Israel. Oh, I told you all for the miss far. Just, just give me a few minutes, Israel. Hallelujah, hallelujah. A mighty Yah that we serve, that shine the light into that darkness of mine. And brought me out. And then to let me know that I'm not alone. That I don't have to go through this battle. By myself. That he told me. That he would give me everything I need. All I have to do is just stand and be obedient unto him and obey his voice as he has told me to abide by his misfire and walk. Not like I used to walk, but walk as a set apart people and to speak of his misfire and of his truth and of his Torah. No matter what I may lose, no matter who may come against me, but still his misfire gives me the strength to go on and trust them until the end, Israel. I can't do nothing but told it, y'all. Because when it seems like we're all alone, his Miss Fox is still there, just right, y'all, to lift us up and carry us on. He's sweet, I know. For I'll tell the world, I found one. He's sweet, I know. For he's one that will never leave his people. 
He's the one who winged it. We can surely get up on it, Israel. For his protection. Oh, totally, yeah. When it seems like we're falling, all we have to do is just reach out to his mitzvah, and it will lift us right back up. Don't give up, Israel. Don't turn. Stand fast. I like the word say, see the salvation of Abba Yahweh. For it's there. You don't try to work it out. And you don't try to do it in your own way. You just leave it to Yah. We make so many mistakes trying to work it out in our own way. Yes, very Yah. But Yah have told us what to do. He have gave us a misfire to abide by. Let us not forget it, Israel. Let it not pass from us, Israel. But let us keep it. As we leave this place, let it stay with us. As we lay down tonight, even though we may sleep at dead man, as we're waking in the morning, let this misfire be upon our land. Because as we're awakening that day, we're going to have a battle, Israel. But still, his mitzvah is still there. Yeah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Yeah. We have gave us the name, Yisrael, elect people, peculiar people. He have gave us something to stand on that name, Yisrael. For you are so tough to us. Do you believe that, Yisrael? For his misfits got to be real within us, Israel. For we can go through the battle, Israel. Yeah, yeah as I came, your Roma, you told us he will not put nothing or no more on us that we can bear. Why? Because he know that we just trust and obey his misfits. That we can overcome every obstacle and every woe. The high said, Tom put against his people. Yeah. Said one could put a thousand, two could put ten thousand. All of us trusting in Mr. Watt, we could put a flight of them. Yeah. Israel. Yeah. And I'm going to trust and believe in that, Israel. Yeah. Because I know for a fact that we serve a mighty one. He is the word made flesh, Israel. So let us be, as the song say, conquerors in Yahshua HaMashiach, trusting in his misfox, Israel. That we stand and go through while we're on this journey just for a little while longer. Walking as a light that's set up on a hill and can't be hid. That light shine bright. That they see that we are set apart, a peculiar people. Not like those of this world. And the only way that could be Israel is his misfox. Be real within our land. And that we trust it to get the victory, Israel. Oh, I told you, yeah, Father Yahweh, I can't help from saying it. Because I know where he bought me from. And I know that he hadn't bought me this far to leave me, Israel. Because he gave me his misfox. And his misfox is going to stand the test of time. For the man got their hope in the material thing, which is going to pass away. And it's only a false hope to them just for a little while. He miss Vox and keep us on until we enter into that male coop. Yes, we are. Hallelujah, hallelujah. 
Israel, y'all. That was my last verse. But Israel, y'all, let us stand to our feet. I want to pray. Abba Yahweh, I told you tonight, Abba Yahweh, for your miss box, your word, to strengthen Israel, to let us know, Abba Yahweh, that we can endure this race until the end, to let us know, Abba Yahweh, in your miss box, that we can go through the battle, that we can stand, Abba Yahweh, trusting in you, Abba Yahweh. To let us know, Abba Yahweh, that we could be that people that you have commanded us to be. That we could be that elect, a people that set up on a hill, Abba Yahweh. A light that can't be hid, Abba Yahweh. For Abba Yahweh, it's time, Abba Yahweh. For your people to stand, Abba Yahweh. To your people to proclaim your truth, Abba Yahweh. For your people not to compromise, Abba Yahweh. Our back down, Abba Yahweh. No matter what come against them, Abba Yahweh. Abba Yahweh, or what they be speak, Abba Yahweh. But Abba Yahweh, your Miss Fox, Abba Yahweh, we know we'll stand, Abba Yahweh. For Abba Yahweh, to, you take us from this old lamb, Abba Yahweh. That Abba Yahweh, we will proclaim your truth, Abba Yahweh. To every four corner of this old lamb, to strengthen Israel, Abba Yahweh. To let them know, Abba Yahweh. Even though they are out there, Abba Yahweh, they're trying to turn them away from your Torah. You have men that will bring them back unto you, Abba Yahweh. Speaking what you have commanded them to speak, Abba Yahweh. The truth according to your Torah, Abba Yahweh. Oh, precious Abba Yahweh, strengthen them, Abba Yahweh. That they stand steadfastness, Abba Yahweh. Oh, feeding your people, Abba Yahweh. For we need one, Abba Yahweh, to feed us, Abba Yahweh. Tell we want no more, Abba Yahweh. To strengthen those that are weary, Abba Yahweh. To strengthen those that seem like to them there's no hope, Abba Yahweh. And there's no one out there, Abba Yahweh. Oh, send the word, Abba Yahweh. To let them know, Abba Yahweh. Just to trust in your miss, Fox, Abba Yahweh. Oh, that they can go on through it, Abba Yahweh. That they can endure it, Abba Yahweh. That they're not alone, Abba Yahweh. But let them know, Abba Yahweh, that they are that voice, Abba Yahweh, that you have, Abba Yahweh, that speak, Abba Yahweh, according to your will, Abba Yahweh, and according to your way, Abba Yahweh. Oh, Abba Yahweh, we rock you tonight, Abba Yahweh. We told you, Abba Yahweh, for those men, Abba Yahweh, that speak according to you have them to speak, Abba Yahweh. Not being afraid, Abba Yahweh. Oh, Abba Yahweh. Not being ashamed of you, Abba Yahweh. But speaking, Abba Yahweh. And speaking loud, Abba Yahweh. To let Satan know, Abba Yahweh. All oh, that your word is out there, Abba Yahweh. All oh, that's going into the high Shemayim, Abba Yahweh. But we know, Abba Yahweh, that Satan's kingdom is coming down, Abba Yahweh. Oh, just for a little while long, Abba Yahweh. Your kingdom's coming down. You've been building it all over this old land, but it is coming down by the mighty word and the Dabah of Yahshua HaMashiach, I pray. Hallelujah, hallelujah.